hi everyone myself jagandev in this video i am just going to cover the topic called how can we uh, preview the pdf files inside the oracle apex so i had just noted some uh, 10 steps if you are follow this 10 steps then we can able to easily achieve this uh, preview pdf file in oracle apex for the time being i just created the page okay so first thing is i'm just going to copy this code and put it in the file url section second thing is i'm just going to copy this javascript code and paste in function and global variable declaration for click save step 3 is we need to create two static regions and also we need to create one classic repo so first region which helps to upload our pdf files i put it as upload pdf files okay and second region which helps to preview the pdf file so i just put it as pdf preview pdf preview so in pdf preview i just put some static ids okay click the save third thing is i'm just going to use this apex application temp files so i'm just created as a report so in the type section i just selected as a classic repo okay right next thing is i need to give the column name so i just copy this code and going to the column section here if you right click this then you can able to create a virtual column so likewise so here i just mark it as plain text and in the html expression section i am just going to paste this code click save i move this report into upload pdf files as a parent region okay next thing is for uploading the files i need to create the page item which is considered as file upload i put it as file upload i set it as a type called file browse and i have set the parent region called upload pdf files click save after that i am just going to create one button to submit the process so i set it as upload pdf file uh, top of the region text same okay we have completed the file browse button next thing is i am just going to create two buttons uh, why i am just doing this creating this buttons in the sense if your pdf having multiple pages then we can use this buttons for as a next and previous things in this i am just putting as a pdf preview top of the region yes and the action will be the de defined by dynamic action and also i am just going to create the another button called next page parent region will be pdf preview and top of the region hot and action will be the dynamic defined by dynamic action yes. okay so after that we need to create one application item so here i just created as file underscore id 
file underscore id and set the status sheet production after that we need to create one application process and i set the point as ajax callback next and i am just going to copy and paste this code there next create process okay so after that we need to create three dynamic actions i think four yeah right so <clears throat> on the click of jquery selector <clears throat> i am going to create on click of dynamic action on click jquery selector i am just going to paste this static query code and i set the action as execute javascript code so here i am just going to paste this code in the javascript code section click okay and save second thing is we need to create another dynamic action on the click of next button next page execute javascript code copy this code and paste it here see again i am just going to create a another dynamic action for previous page button on click of button previous page i am going to execute this javascript code click save finally we need to create only one dynamic action on page load create i put the heading as on page load i am going to execute three actions here first action will be execute javascript code so in this code i need to copy this code i need to paste this code and set the selection type as jquery selector as jquery preview tag second thing is again we need to create execute javascript code and copy this code and selection type will be our button next page and create one more action execute javascript code for previous page button copy this code and paste it here and affected item will be a button for previous page click save so i'm just going to upload the file sample pdf one open and click the submit so now the file has been uploaded here when you click the i symbol we can able to view the pdf here say you can able to view the pdf if your pdf have multiple pages i will show you that also so sample pdf 2 open and click the submit sample pdf 2 see now you can able to see and this pdf having multiple uh, pages so i'm just going to click the next page now the 
data has been changed as you can see next page next page previous page you can go for a previous pages if you want to change the pdf you can simply click the i symbol and automatically it will change so thank you uh, so much for watching